In the previous video, we showed how to search and open a project from a remote repository powered by Git. We will be using this sample project to highlight Factory Talk Design Studio's modern development workflows. Factory Talk Design Studio has a modern web integrated development environment, or IDE, with a simple, clean, and customizable layout, as well as modern software development practices. The first example of this are Smart Objects or SOs, which is a method of implementing object oriented programming to a user's design projects. SOs give a user the ability to develop standard code and encapsulate it to be reused throughout a project. This simple method further cuts down on development and deployment time and effort. Notice the SOs parent-child hierarchy. These object instances are singleton smart objects as they are not inherited or derived from a smart object definition. We'll touch on this later. Focusing on the header SO instance, Notice the icon indicates it is a linked or inherited SO. Looking at its properties, the user can identify the smart object definition that this instance is linked to. Drilling into the supply program and opening a routine, notice it says read only at the top right. This indicates that the routine is an instance of a definition. Therefore, we would have to modify the source definition in the library pane. However, Users have the ability to add smart objects to the library from this system pane. For example, what if a user wanted to make updates to the supply program, but still keep the old code to be able to support legacy machines? They can override the supply program, make the necessary code changes, and add the updated smart object to the library as a new header SO. The supply program indicates inheritance, similar to return, but they are now part of the new gen header definition, as seen in the properties. 